two o'clock at um, the office, um, right in, in the edge of uh, the hall. Um, yeah, I think that's it for the um, for the routes and uh, restrictions. It's our fifth anniversary this time. Um, <laughs> thank you. Uh, so I can pretty good remember uh, when we've been here the, for the for the first time, and I think basically we we left everything as it was. It's just one thing we dropped that was a restriction of number of participants. It was I think about 300, 350, and uh, I'm I'm not sure if it was a good idea to drop that because it's a little bit more crowded this time, but. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy to, to see so, so many people here. Um, when people are asking me about uh, the event here, I'm always going to say, well, we, we do have an unfair advantage. It's uh, the, the very close distance to, to Billund, which gives us some, some benefits uh, other, other events don't have. But in fact, there is another very important thing other facilities can't provide, and that's the location itself. Um, we have here um, lots of space for, for the models, and even more important, we have lots of space for, for the people to, to stay here. So still, you have the chance to really join the, the fan weekend together with fans for 24 hours a day. And this is, is uh, quite rare to, to find. And beside of that, we, we have the, the very nice people who welcome us from the Scabec Center. And so, without any more notes to say, I would like to pass to Sören. Thank you very much. It is a pleasure to have you here at Scabec. So, we enjoy it very much. Dear all LEGO fans, as the manager of the Skavik Center, it is a great, a great pleasure for me to welcome you here to Skavik Fan Weekend 2019. I must admit that I was a bit proud when Stefan asked me to do the welcome speech here today. Ever since the first LEGO Fan Weekend here in Skavik in 2005, this event has connected both LEGO, your LEGO fans, as well as our center together. We are looking very much forward to this weekend. At LEGO they call it, only the best is good enough. This also applies for the team behind the Scavic Fan Weekend. Every year after, uh, an evaluation is conducted and we do our best to make the event even better for next year. Both for you, but also for the public guests who will visit uh, the event in the coming days. Imagine, this year is the 15th time, yes, 15 year in a row that Skærbæk Fan Weekend is hosted here in Skærbæk. And what a success. It grew to a fantastic event. It is amazing that you come here year after year to visit us here in the Skærbæk Center. I'm so happy about it. This year we have uh, 1100 participants and almost uh, 700 LEGO fans. That's correct, from about 35 different countries around the world. That is great. And give yourself a big hand. I think it's amazing. I clearly remember around 16 years ago when Jan Bayer suggested to make a LEGO fan we get here in Skærbæk. Let's do it, I said quickly. And then the first event was in the pipeline. I don't know where Jan is, but there he is. <laughs> we did not have so many LEGO fans as today, but we got started. The first year we only filled up a half sport hall, and today you can see both is full. The first 10 years also LEGO took part at the driving force of the LEGO Fan Weekend. But the last five years, the current event group with 11 people, and Stefan and Thomas as the steering team, has taken over and are today arranging the fan weekend. Thank you to all of you.
We are very much uh, proud of you and also happy for the cooperation we have together with you. I, I feel really that Skabek Center today is closely connected to the Skabek Fan Weekend. And that's good for us and good for you, I hope. And what is it that make all your LEGO fans meet here in Skabek? Of course it's LEGO. And here you also can share your passion for the LEGO bricks with other LEGO fans. I can see you create so much of the LEGO bricks and uh, your exhibition here is a clear evidence to this. And then a bit of local information for you. Are you actually aware that you have come to a well-known national park? No? I don't think you are aware. You know that. Skabek Center is uh, very close to the Wattensee National Park. Danish nature at its best. If you drive to the west to Rundle, you will reach the Wattensee, a magnificent march and tidal flat area. Both the tide and the waves transform the landscape every single day when the water is coming in from the north sea. An amazing nature area that since 2014 got the World Heritage Site from the UNESCO also. If you get the time, I'm not sure, then you should take the opportunity to uh, take a ride to the water sea to remember and uh, enjoy the incredible nature. And then it's not only me who keeps looking forward to the last weekend of September every year. So does all my colleagues here in the center also. Andy, I'm sure you know, he has been here the whole time. <laughs> and we enjoy welcoming you together with all of the other kids today and tomorrow will uh, visit us in Scarborough. Welcome, dear LEGO fans. I hope you may have some pleasant days in Scarborough. And with these words, I declare the Scabbing Fan Weekend for open. Thank you. Because we have prepared something for you. It's our way to say thank you for hosting us all the years. And I admit we are a little bit selfish because we made it so big that it's too big for our office. find a decent place somewhere around your facility. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. 